Good morning, boys and girls. This is our shared reading for Monday, June 8th. Please follow along with me as we read about energy. When people talk about energy, what do they mean? Place a check mark next to each picture that you think shows energy. And I know we're on the computer, so you can just kind of point to which ones you think show energy. Let's look at these different pictures. So in this picture, I see the caption, which is a group of words describing a picture. When the power went out, I turned on a flashlight. Has anybody ever done that before? Do you think that is showing energy? Next picture, the butter melted when I heated it on the stove. Last picture, the crowd made so much noise that we could feel it. Have you ever been somewhere where it's so loud or the music was so loud that you could just kind of feel it in your arms or your legs or your chest? Let's see, which one of those is showing energy? They all do. Energy comes in many different forms. So this week, we will learn about three forms of energy, heat, light, and sound. So let's talk about the first one. Heat is a form of energy. Have you ever seen a pot of water on a hot stove? First, the pot gets hot. Then the water gets hot. Adding heat energy to water makes it boil. What does water look like when it boils? Hmm. Yeah, you kind of see it start to bubble up and you see steam coming off of it at the top. You can see the effects of the heat energy. Heat makes most things larger. Larger means bigger. Blow up a balloon and tie it shut. Put the balloon in the freezer for one hour. What do you think will happen to the balloon once you put it in the freezer? Hmm. Well, heat makes things larger and the freezer is gonna make them cooler. The balloon loses heat energy in the freezer. How did the balloon change? So they're asking you to visualize right now. Visualize means make a picture in your head. Think about how the balloon might have changed if it's losing its heat. So I'm thinking that if it's getting losing heat and heat makes things bigger, then the heat getting taken away will make it, yeah, maybe smaller. Look at its size and shape. Now put the balloon in the hot sunlight. The balloon gains heat energy in the sunlight. How does the balloon change? Look again at its size and shape. So visualize that. If you put the balloon back in the sun, which is more heat energy, it might get, yeah, it might get bigger again. And let's look at the caption under this. The water is gaining heat energy. The heat causes the water to boil, okay? All right, well, we'll, we'll talk about this some more. And please keep in mind what we just read today so you can answer your writing discussion question. See you again tomorrow. Bye-bye.